Hi guys, welcome back. This is our second tutorial over on uh, REST API with Perl. So, uh, first of all, I want to give you uh, just a little bit brief about uh, first part of uh, uh, curl with REST API. That is, we are uh, just make a small program of curl in which we are just initialized or uh, curl then a return transfer is uh, have to two for uh, getting result and after that put a url in curl and then just print and the url is that is belong to our api and api is here so this is the brief of uh, a basic rest api with curl and now i'm going to make a database connectivity with API and put it in JSON format because JSON format is the most popular format with the REST API. So let's start, guys, with this. Okay. So here I I'm going to connect with the local host now. So we need a connect and make a instant of mysql i class and put the four parameter that belong to localhost that belong to mysql i class first is localhost this is a user uh, server name second is root this is username and third one is password that is null by default and fourth one is uh database name so let's check our database name here first of all our database name is test so pass test here so uh, actually this is a basic program of database connectivity uh, that will use with the rest api so next we need a query SQL name to that and select star from table name and what's the table name? This is user that have three data. Okay, from user and now. We need a result from database. This is as dollar connect and put it with the query that handle dollar SQL variable and fire a query. And after that, for fetching data, we need while loop. And first of all, we have to put it here. Printer dollar. Let's check uh, the connectivity of database is working fine or not. Uh, check in API file. Yes, this is working fine. So take it in a array and that will be converted in JSON format. Make a variable of array type and that will handle the whole data. That is coming from database and now print our dollar collect. And now let's see the result. It should be same. 
या विद द वन एक्स्ट्रा अरे सो लेट्स कन्वर्ट टेम into json format for that we use json in quote dollar collect variable should be passed to them and now let's check is is it converted in json format yes this is converted in json format now come here and see the result first of all is our api it is uh the result will be appeared here so just see yes the result is here now uh let's suppose we want to convert it back in array so uh inta okay so that i want to first of all i want to decode that dollar refine are let's take a variable name and json decode back to array so result and if you pass here to that means the result will be uh, will be converted into the uh, array so now we need a for each loop and i'm going to print here and here refine result as a value now just i want to go see here just name and let's see the result here yeah we got result but we have to remove echo and put a br tag here yes you can see here in database name we have three name jitendra jitendra and john so three results are getting here and this is a proper api okay that purpose of this tutorial is i want to show that curl can able to handle the api result in any format like json array and how second purpose is how we can use rest api with curl in mysqli data and third one is we can uh, handle the api data uh, on a client side also you can see here that is that is come from here is fully data and you can see in api file this is api.php the api.php this is a full data here so when we take it on uh, curl.php file and that time we refine it as an array and just print just got the name of uh just got a name from the database not id or whole data so this is quite little bit simple and if you want to take just id you can pass your just id one to three ids are one two and three okay guys so thank you for watching this video thank you so much guys and after that the third tutorial about uh 
most secure data with security key and hash key. Uh, next tutorial we will send a most secure data and we will get a most secure data from API with the security key and hash key so that we can make it more secure. So don't forget to watch the third tutorial and if you don't see the basics of uh, if you want to see the basics of curl with rest api you can go to our uh, previous tutorial otherwise this is also basic you can i know uh, this is also is a uh, understandable format of json with php uh, json with the curl and in rest api so thank you guys thanks for watching and Please subscribe our channel for more videos and uh, share the videos. Thanks guys. Thanks so much.